What's going on guys, Game360Bro here, bringing you guys another video, and today, um, sorry for the lack of uploads, but, uh, I'm gonna be explaining to you that I was actually in a tournament, a baseball tournament, in London, <clears throat> London, Ontario, and we actually won the tournament, and we came first place, so, uh, Southwest London Tournament Champions, and... I'm going to be showing you one more thing, and then I'm going to be telling you kind of what happened during the tournament. Like, I guess what happened, yeah. So, here is the little bat that we got. It's a Rawlings bat from National Sports. London SW Southwest Tournament Champions. And then also the Crest. This is from National Sports. And also, the shirt is from National Sports as well. And, yeah. So, what happened, basically, in the first game, we lost against a team named the Mustangs. In the second game, we won against the team named the Tigers. And I'm going to be telling you what, like, how many hits I got in each game. So, in the first game, I went 3 for 4. In the second game, I went 4-4-4. Four, four, four. In the third game, I went 2-4-4. Four, four. And in the fourth game, I went 2-4-4 four, four as well. So, yeah. Those are my stats. And in the first game, I was back catcher, which I love being back catcher, shortstop, second base. You already know those. I believe I might have mentioned that. <coughs> And, um, second game, I was, uh, second base, I think. I'm pretty sure. Oh, no, 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 I was back catcher against the Mustangs. I was back catcher against the Tigers, so back-to-back -back games with being back catcher. And then I was second base for, against, I don't remember what team we faced. Oh, yes, I did. We actually, in the third game, we actually faced the Southwest team, the Southwest London team, and... I was the second baseman, and, oh no, I was the second baseman in, against the Tigers, and then in the Southwest team game, I was catcher, but um, in the last game, I was pitching for three innings, and then I played right field the rest of the other, like, four, three or four innings, because it's a seven-inning game, I pitched three innings. And yeah, I just played the rest in right field. So yeah. But anyways, in the final game we faced the Mustangs again. And we won against the Mustangs. So that was pretty good because my friend actually said he, out of the South, because the Southwest team and the Mustangs had to play off in a game to see who would win because we were already the first place team anyways. And then the Mustangs, is what my friend said, they probably were more confident that they would probably win because they already beat us the first game, right? And that was exactly not at all the case. It's just we couldn't get our hits going. And the pitchers, was, the pitchers weren't even fast. We just couldn't hit them. Sometimes we're like that. But, um, yeah, we did really good in that tournament. Yeah. And so, against the Mustangs in the final game, I mentioned I was pitcher, and I got on base two out of four times. And it was just, it was overall a very fun experience. So, we, there was a lot of kids, though, on Mustangs. There was about two or three kids who actually cried because my friend hit an inside the park to run home run, right? And, uh... We actually got to vote for who think who we think should be the MVP of the whole tournament. He already won MVP of the game one time. And he should have won it multiple times because he was... He's normally... He always says he's not a good hitter, that he doesn't get on base. In that tournament, that, that was the first time he ever got on base. And he got on base every single at-bat except for, like, two. And we played four or five games. And he had, like... 4, 8, 12. He had like 16 at-bats. So, he did really good. We voted him as the MVP. And the pitcher, as soon as he threw his glove on the ground, I was like, oh crap, he's about to start bawling his eyes out. Exactly what happened was, 
he started bawling his eyes out. And then he went off, and another team guy came in. But I'm going to mention that the Southwestern team, or the London team, I can kind of understand how they won a few games. Because originally they were the first place team. They had two, they were the only team with two wins and no losses. And then we came along and faced a game with them. We beat them. Then that gave us first place title. And then in the final game to decide, like, London or Mustangs, well, in the second final game, um, the Mustangs won against them. So then London was 2-2. Two and two. But the reason that they won the two games in the first place is they kept their pitchers under 75 pitches, which is the maximum total you could have for a pitcher. And the thing about that is, though, they didn't just do that. But, like, when we faced them, we had a new pitcher, like, every inning. We'd have starting pitcher, and then that inning, we got, like, we got a few runs. So then they switched. The shortstop went to pitcher, and then the pitcher went to shortstop, and it just kept switching around. And then there was another, and it's not that they got hit that they started crying. They just started crying because they, so we have this thing in house league called the mercy rule. So five runs in inning means that you have to switch to the outfield, right? You have to switch, I guess, positions and just because it's been the mercy rule. But in the tournament, I don't, I don't play house league. I play travel baseball as well. So... The, but we did have a mercy rule. It was if you're winning, so it's not a five run mercy rule, but if you're winning by ten runs in a game, just in the game total, then it's a mercy rule and then your team automatically wins. It was 17 to 6, so our team took home the victory.